Andre Snott, he got the forearm arm up a little bit on RJ Cole, who nearly loses the handle here. Whaley hasn't gotten much action inside. Finishes nicely with the left hand. When to attack, when to rise up, take the bump. And there's the co-Big East Defensive Player of the Year from last season, Isaiah Whaley. I think these fans are going to be more excited about a block shot this season than they are about any other play on the floor. Great timing. Here he is off the curl, lays it off for Whaley on the baseline. Their coaches, you know, the, the not just the fiery guys, but it's the personality of, of what our league has been. Whaley off the curl, and that's a goaltend. Snotty got up. Nice job by Scantleberry to get his hand in there. Sonogo using the left. Martin, and now Whaley finishes it. They just keep coming at you. There's a block from behind by Isaiah Whaley. It's so DC. Notre Dame was scheduled last year to take on Howard. Taking on that team, if I'm not mistaken, this season. Flowers, their leading scorer, his first attempt off balance, battling for the offensive rebound. Blocked from behind by Whaley. Polly kept his foot on the ground. Ball in traffic, finds Whaley somehow for the easy lay-in. They deserve rest. Davis trying to get around the corner, blocked from behind and taken away by Whaley. Bertram lays it off, another denial this time by Whaley. Taking the Huskies over Louisville, Maryland, Marquette and others now a turnover up ahead to Hawkins. Hey, seen him before, Whaley off. Now Sonogo, just short, and Whaley again. And that's why Connecticut is top five in college basketball and offensive rebounding rate. Sonogo downstairs to Whaley, who was left alone, and he'll head to the line for a pair as Falco commits the foul. George Tinsley with just his second bucket of the game. Floating, that doesn't fall. Whaley was fouled, though, and Isaiah Whaley will head back to the line. Turnover into the hands of Devin Cambridge. Jabari Smith, one-on-one. -on -one. Left hand, no good, and he was challenged at the rim by Whaley. Double up, going to pop Kessler. Went by him, and look at that. Good defense that time by Whaley, who goes over to the bench, and... He celebrates with the Huskies. A finesse finish. He's around and you throw your arm around to get in the, in, into the play. UConn very good at it so far in this game. Hard take, turnover. He's on the floor, he's in a little pain. Down the other way, Green blocked there by Gaffney. He's the 50-50 ball. Sonogo, Whaley, Jackson, too strong. Rebound, Whaley. He's doing the dirty work and he will go to the free throw line. Isaiah Whaley doing the little things here late in this game. Defensive end, they got to get it on the glass. They have to find a way to get some in transition today. Talking about the team in black. Now Cole had a chance for a three. Now Whaley will fire away, and that's in. How about Isaiah Whaley knocking down a three-pointer? We got UConn on the board. <laughs> get it out of here, right? Good. Keep the ball moving. Just keep it moving. Oh, he steps through and there here's you Hawkins. Go. There you go. I don't know that was, that should have gone in. <laughs> Whaley cleans up the miss on the glass. It's one of the uncommon facts that people don't realize about a basketball. Whaley with the hedge and a little bounce to Gaffney. He misses. Count it. Walk out of here again with a loss. Gaffney. Martin Corner had a chance. Good play, Whaley had great position underneath, and he laid it up and in. Really good find by Martin, he's such a hard cover. What's he gonna do? He's not gonna pass it. He's gonna have to here, and he does. Whaley will shoot a three, find the bottom. We are tied with a minute to go. That, I, I, I'm being honest, I think that was the first pass out of the post by Sonogo. Taken in this game by, by both teams. Again, Cole double team. That time Jackson showed Whaley three wide open. 
And Isaiah Whaley knocks it down. That's his third three of the game. And Isaiah Whaley, who missed yesterday after fainting, four point game with six seconds to go. And here's Whaley ahead of the field. That's a he lays it in. That's a foul. Could escalate to an F1 because he's in a vulnerable position off the floor. Well, the guy that fainted after game one, didn't play game two, has had himself an incredible game with that lay-in. Isaiah Whaley. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I think you stick with a common foul. You mentioned Philip Moore, the guard two years ago that played as a scoring guard, now is a tough guard. But you can give him a month off before you really start getting into the Big East schedule. And he still has plenty of season left. It looks for Whaley. Yeah, it would have been illegal. <laughs> Offensive glass, no. Bounce back to Whaley, fouled, and back to the line. It, Phillip on the pull-up, no. Cole, the tremendous rebound. Here's where they got to be careful, though. Gaffney, alley-oop. See, that, you've got to try to be more aggressive now. Davis, the block, and he was sitting out of bounds with the ball in top of it. Good bounce pass to Pollard. Could not find it. Whaley's long arms got in the way. And great help by Hawkins, by the way. They get him down to the end of the shot clock and gain it nothing. The drive and it's stuck. Again, it's the reigning defensive player of the year in the conference making a play at the rim. That's why Danny Hurley loves Isaiah Whaley so much. That is a clean, great block. UConn on a roll here. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe from my angle, he got hit harder than I thought. I'm not sure. Oh, almost lost the ball. Almost traveled. Got blocked. Batted around. Phillip on the drive. High floater. Doesn't get it to go. Cole on the leak out. Two on two. With a bucket. No. Will. Who else? You need a play. Rebound is tapped around. Inside of 20 seconds to go. Davis to the hole. Whaley another block. And that's going to end it. Boy, that, that guy Cole, he comes at you so many different ways. Seven turnover of the game for the Tigers. It will result in points at the other end. And staying with it on the offensive glass. Whaley. Cole got it back. Shot clock is deep. Trying to work that baseline, fouled on the jumper, Whaley, and the Tigers might have bailed out UConn late in the shot clock there. They're number 11 and one. Fancy dribble from Moten. Tries to work it baseline, he got double teamed down there, and Whaley came over to get a piece of it. And that's what Whaley does. He's got that size, he blocks a lot of shots. There he's a steal right there, and again, Connecticut on the fast break. Cole couldn't get the bounce. Run down in the corner by Johnson. And then a foul against Grambling on the way up. And have a, and start off with a record like that. But congratulations to him. Had a guy named Dwayne Wade on that, that ball club. Yeah, he did. That wasn't a bad team. No. That was Parrish on the offensive glass. The ball rolls to Whaley. So Grambling had a chance at it there, coach. Just couldn't cash it in. And now Whaley with the rim bender and jam on the feed from Polly. Blocked or deflected, and that's really affecting them offensively. Free throw line jumper, and that is all net from Whaley. He, now he does have a really good change of pace now. He'll, he'll give you that one hard dribble like James Harden does. Hawkins in trouble. Whaley. Cole trying to get downhill. He's so shifty. He gets his own rebound. Back to Whaley, who did a nice job to corral it, and soft touch in the lane for their first field goal. Cole saves the rebound. Here comes UConn. Jackson with a nice catch. Bounce pass and laid up and in by Isaiah Whaley. Well, Hawkins is an unbelievable talent. He's getting the minutes now without Martin, and he will develop quickly. People rave about him in the UConn program as well. As a cook and forced their fair share of turnovers as well. Almost 18 a game. Osa Boyan inside blocks the shot. You were just talking about it. Whaley blocked it. Osa. Minutes out there starting. 
these guys didn't play again in front of any crowd, so to speak, a year ago. So getting used to this atmosphere. Shot clock already down to 18. They were still at the logo. Jackson bounce pass. That's beautiful pass. Whaley finishes. Top of the one three one at six nine, giving UConn some problems. Three no, a cook, a cook, put back, doesn't go. Another chance though for Whaley. Same bottom as we expect. They're shooting in the Whaley. That shot was altered by Isaiah Whaley. It'll be one for three today. But you're gonna get better looks, right? That's a good look, it's just a bad miss. Holmes to the 10, and that's denied by both Whaley and Jackson. The crowd is at its full throat and loudest here in the first half. Whaley from Gaffney, good find by Jalen Gaffney and Isaiah Whaley, the two-year Husky with a finish. I'm still a long recovery, but he looks better at Cooper. He can shoot. No chance to. I think you've got to continue to be more patient. I think Attaway's been aggressive with the basketball, but you've got to be solid. You've got to be patient. You can't turn. Mark Schmidt with some last-second coaching for Ashuni before he checks into the game. Whaley is left alone. Whaley rattles in a long two. Isaiah Whaley with his second field goal. What do you think? Ran off the left side. But these two teams, as I was saying, Donnie, they were using words this week like battle-tested and Whaley knocked it down to three. Providence starting two of six from the floor. UConn two of eight. Durham has it rejected by Isaiah Whaley. Parkler, quick pass inside. Watson using the pivot foot. Rejection by Whaley. Sometimes players, you gotta have a, gotta get rid of that, that for short-term memory. Another nice slip pass. R.J. Cole dropping the dime inside. Really working this kid as well in the previous staff, but opted to be a fryer. Cole, off balance. Look at Whaley battling inside. Boy, Whaley, they call him the rim. Has, and his teammates get out of the way and let him go to work. Oh boy, the instincts, because Whaley is a tremendous shot blocker. Whaley just picked up a foul on Lewis. Mm. Martin tosses to Whaley, and he cans the 15 footer. That's a clutch jumper. Columbus, New Jersey. This town school in Pennsylvania where he prepped. Probing and looking for a cutter down low. There it is. Whaley rattling it home. Johnson giving it back up to Whaley. Oh, what a baker! Roden past Whaley was deflected by Isaiah. So it just makes them stand a little longer, but it's a dead ball <laughs> turnover, so you get a chance to get back and try to get a stop. You leave him alone, that ball hits his fingers, it's too late. Turned over, taken away by Whaley. Ray Jackson. Sonogo gives it up, and a two-hand flush by Isaiah Whaley, his first bucket tonight. Wheeler touched like a running back denied for your teammates. Now they got a lot of time left here, 10 minutes, but start kicking this thing in if you're St. John's. Both teams with the bonus now. Whaley looked like a travel, and he spins around and puts it in. Now Mike Anderson has to go deeper into his bench. A block. Coach McCaffrey knows how to feature his players. They have gifts and skill. Put them in position to be successful. AZ rejected again, this time by Whaley. Tonight. Andre Jackson takes the Whaley screen, feeds at the free throw line. Good offense from UConn. Or vice versa, it was Phil, Phil Nova shutting him out in two against the Huskies on Tuesday. Phil Nova shut the entire team down, KB. That falls for Isaiah Whaley as he slipped the screen. And Taylor caught with his second personal foul. Now Gaffney on the offensive board, Whaley with the left. 
There it is, Wong. Martin with five. Through two Bulldogs. Put back up and in by Whaley. And you might see it in Butler team. They need him to activate his scoring ability. Golden back door. Taylor denied. RJ Cole with the poise on the ball and the putback from Isaiah Whaley. Now they get it to Sunogo. Down low again. Shot won't go. Whaley cleans it up. Counted in one. Isaiah Whaley. Picked up his second foul. Jackson to Sunogo. Up fake and shot no good, but Whaley is there for two. Offensive rebound. Cole with the shot clock at five. All the way to the hoop. Shot no good. Tip by Whaley. Whaley gets it back again. And Whaley is getting it done down low. Get the bounce. So you heard it from Dan Hurley with Sherry at the half. He was not happy with UConn's defense. Whaley for two. And now the fans can sit down. You turn it over, especially against a juggernaut like UConn. Call to Willie for the flush. That's how you break the pressure. Exactly. This year against San Diego State. Jackson all the way. Wild shot. No. Willie again. Willie now has 13 points to go along with five rebounds. Holly left alone for three. And there he is again. What a night for Isaiah Whaley. Unbelievable. Somebody better put a body on him. Another block as Whaley comes over for the switch. I love his attitude on the floor. You got to take away his left, but he can go the other way with a cross. Whaley shut that down. And this is a kid that has a big upside, don't you think? Absolutely. Sonogo doubled and the dime to Whaley. Not a great shooter. Gonna be better though, Jackson. Another offensive rebound for the Huskies. Tough. And Whaley sticks it back. How about that shot, huh? Your attitude. <laughs> <laughs> Just one of those games, right? Went yeah. 19. Up 17. They got 19 in a row. Nice counter. Isaiah Whaley starting hot with all seven. And no stoppages. Jackson. And the putback's there for Whaley. Goodness. To nice. the corner. An open O'Connell. Offensive board for Kaufbrenner, and that shot altered. Jordan Hawkins. Offensive board for Whaley. Gets it back and whams it down. That's what Gaffney's got to do. Find the guy, finish the deal. It must be divine intervention. That's the Big East. Whaley. The answer. Well, if he can make a couple of those, all of a sudden, Hawkins has got to come out and play him. Hawkins again, letting Willie have it. Time. That's two he's made. Nemhard off to Fiesel. He was shut down by the wrench. Once more. Laying off Willie. He's made a couple. How about that? Number three. Well, at what point, Raph? Every time it happens, Hawkins goes over the bench, should I come out? <laughs> come out. Solid defender inside. Nice play as yeah. Sonogo dumps it down and Whaley right to the basket. All he had to do is catch and finish. 18-14. Inside Whaley nice. and finally the Huskies stop the bleeding. Jay Wright, Gillespie. Nice look again. Dixon hesitated. And he waited for the defense to come to him. Nice, nice clean nice. inside. Nice layup, Hawkins. With the feed. Kolek right in his face. Nothing you can do. Put a hand up. Just don't foul a jump shooter. You can live with that. Got to get the ball in the right guy's hand, though. Late clock. There he is. And Whaley was just untouched for the offensive rebound and then a foul it's a full head of steam but without Cole on the floor Sonogo you think 
on the other end. And in the last minute and 20, they have. Whaley with two hands. Great answer. Two excellent three-point shooters that need to knock down shots for UConn. Hey. Obi Jones had his Whaley. Whaley a deep two, and he splashes it from the top of the key. Such a versatile player. Odom. Had his shot altered on the reverse, and then a rejection of Fremantle by Whaley. Job running and posting up right in the middle. Reminds me of Alonzo Mourning back in the day. And Jeff Benny inside. And with this lineup, does most of it has to come from the perimeter. Nice slip, Whaley. Good recognition with the board. Here he is. Slip, Whaley. Yeah. Up and in. Good job, RJ Cole. Cole. Those shots will fall. Connecticut shooting 37%. Nay Wusu is 12. To St. John's. A Whaley. Wheeler. Down the lane. Another one blocked again by Whaley. Smith ahead. Soriano gathers. Blocked from behind by Williams. Yukon has missed their last six shots. Cole's got to get busy to the bucket. And a nice tip in by Whaley. In the corner. Martin. In and out. Whaley offensive board. Has player. Jackson's open for a moment, puts it on the deck. Shot clock is under 10, he lost control. He's putting on his own dribbling display. Can't finish, Shinogo with the rebound. I don't know if we'll reach the same point total in this one. That was 90-87, uh, to 87. this is 28-27. And how about how wide open Isaiah Whaley was inside the paint, Shinogo. Jackson, quickly in for Shinogo. Double team, Whaley for three. Protect Richmond with the zero so he doesn't get in foul trouble. And also try to slow down Obiago. Bailey for the free throw line. Ten balls around and goes down. Loves the 94 foot style. He's rejected this time by Whaley. Defensively there by Juan Odom, number 11. This is a good Xavier defensive team. He defended that well. Whaley gets the offensive board there and cleans it up. Rams sucking the defense in as well as filling the wings. Beautifully done by Whaley. He can ignite in a hurry. In traffic, another rejection. Whaley this time. An opportunities, recycles. 63 seconds, and it was Cole's rebound yeah. on the offensive end that enabled him to score. Four to shoot, working on Jackson. Slater inside to Dixon. Shot clock violation. Drag across the top. Look at the load up in the lane. So now go back out to the open man. Whaley for three. That barely tickled the twine. Oh, he's a... Ten to shoot. Martin inside. Whaley with the offensive board. Oh, a little physical play down low. And Whaley muscles it in. Well, they're letting him play, too. Maybe a bump on that one. Got to bounce your way in. See how they help out. Sonogo. A great job on the top by Samuel. Oh, look at Whaley. Climbing on the offensive glass. It's a tie game. Samuels rolled all the way around and out to Jackson. And Andre Jackson so fast with the ball in his hands. Oh. Up the floor. Whaley blocking foul. He'll go to the line. Uh, Slater really picked up the charge, too, at the foul area on the pass. Shoot the ball. Goodness, man. Long pass ahead, and Jackson's going to outrace everybody for that one. Now to the other end. Oh, what a speed! Oh, my goodness! Moore with 12, one of four Wildcats in double figures tonight. Three Huskies in doubles. Cole, one of them with 10. The entry to Whaley, almost the end one. He'll get two at the line. Good foul by Daniels, though. You know, automatic deuce. Make him work for it. To three, just over four minutes gone by. Cole weaving through traffic, and that jumper's off the mark. Whaley, the offensive rebound, put back, and he is fouled. Isaiah Whaley will shoot two when we come back. He can dribble, he can struggle.
Good pass. Matumbo blocked by Whaley. And comes the other way. I mean, he had two in a row that absolutely 100% have to be finished. Whaley for three. And the wrist is okay. Just his 13th three of the year. In those days, he wanted to take it to the basket because there were no threes. Now, you get behind the line, two shot. Great defense by Whaley and Hawkins, and they create the turnover. And he may be right when you, th when you think about inside and outside. Martin bounces it to Whaley for two more, and now UConn is scoring at ease. Celebrated the Big East regular season title last night on their home floor. Whaley jumper is good. Isaiah Whaley, and a good sign there. We were a little concerned earlier about the wrist, but he's... Cole to Whaley, another three. It's good. Whaley had 12 threes all year. He's got two today. We've got a combined 34 fouls in this game. Jackson, nice layoff to Whaley. I really like Isaiah Whaley a lot. Cole with Alexander on his hip, kicks it to Whaley. The three drops for Whaley. UConn right back in it within four against Creighton on Thursday, but it took him 16 shots to get there. He's already got 12 over the first eight and a half minutes of the game. All name team, right? Uh -huh. It's gotta be. Adonis Arms from Texas Tech, he's gotta be on it. That's there. How about Flandris Fleming from Florida? Boy, you can't prepare with the names. <laughs> Isaiah Whaley has his first points. Whaley's got a pretty cool name and an awesome game. He is there. Nice pass. Whaley, the beneficiary, senior to senior on this senior night. Is no defense on that. Sonogo, the help comes. Whaley comes loose. That's the risk to take if you win a double, and UConn promptly makes him pay. Up into the quarter weather here for senior campaign. Whaley, teardrop. Whaley steps back. He's showing off some versatility in this offensive game. On Saturday in stores, Huskies led by 17. So this is a new matchup, and there's a whole way to build it. This little approach. With Whaley, yeah. It's not Sonogo's game in there. Ooh, a nice catch by Whaley, jumps up short. Gets his own rebound again. It's uh, pretty good. I think that was with the left hand, too. I got blocked out a little bit. Samuel, good job. Great offensive rebound by Samuel. Just rips it away. Double play goes up. Oh, Jackson is aware of the roll. Nice switch by Sonogo. Block from behind by Whaley. Richmond, step back, jump. Oh, no. That was Carson. In no man's land, Samuel rejected by Whaley. And it's Daniels, Dixon, Daniels on the drop. Rejected by Whaley. Baseline, Daniels blocked out of bounds by Whaley. Gillespie's probing. Samuel for a jumper block. And this UConn team, you like how they play on the defensive end. You, you love how they consistently compete as they get the block shot right there. They need to get the ball to. Yeah. RJ Coles has got it. They need to get the ball to. The transfer from Howard had 1,500 points. As we see a bucket right there from UConn. The transfer. I see UConn's making a concerted effort to show Allen some attention to that pick and roll. They sure are. Quick trap right there. Oh, drive and Whaley swatted that one out of there. Cole had to pick up his dribble. Whaley on the outside. Got it. His second jumper. Isaiah Whaley gives UConn the lead. This UConn team has pride. They're not going to go away. Whaley, three-pointer. Got it. Back-to-back -back triples by the Huskies. And just like that, they're right back in. The rebound is fifth of the night. 
And no foul called there as Whaley got a piece of that shot. Price on Cole. Or trying to stay with Cole. Jackson inside. Found his free man. And Whaley. 